Hi, I'm Joel Simmons for another Two Minute Turf Talk. Boron is one of the most misunderstood of all the trace elements. It is a negatively charged anion, which means it can easily tie up and become very unavailable. It's not used in large quantities, but the, it is an essential element for a number of key functions within the plant. In particular, it's very involved in the transportation of calcium and potassium. It is generally recognized as the gatekeeper for calcium. That means if it's not in the soil profile, calcium mobility or the uptake of calcium into the plant becomes very difficult. It's very important in the energy transportation in the plant, carbohydrate movement into the plant, in building a stronger root system, uh, but it can only move up in the xylem. It cannot move down. So it's not a very good foliar feeding product. As you can see in this soil test, we often see this less than sign next to uh, boron on the soil sample. And what that tells us is that mobility is just not there. The plant is not getting adequate levels. So yes, a liquid form of boron is important, but don't think of it as a foliar feed. Think of it as a soil feed and get it into that root zone so that the plant can then take it up and start to function with it effectively. Here at Earthworks, we use boron in a lot of our products and particularly, in Calvantage because we know that that boron is essential in getting the calcium to move into the plant. We also have it in products like Trilogy and Micronite so that there are programs that you can find boron fairly effectively and get them into the soil where you really need it. So your plants don't find the stress that can be caused by the lack of boron. Thank you very much.